Makerere University College of Health Sciences, in partnership with Uganda People's Defense Forces, UPDF, have embarked on a clinical trial to treat COVID-19 using antibodies from recovered patients. It's now my honor and pleasure to officially launch the convalescent plasma study and to direct the scientists to begin the clinical trials tomorrow for God and my country. The Minister of Health, Dr. Jane Ruth Cheng, who launched a clinical trial this morning at Makere University, said this scientific innovation is a milestone for Uganda in fighting the pandemic. COVID-19 has no treatment. What is given currently is supportive. So having convalescent plasma come on board is great. This perhaps is the beginning of a success story for the scientists in Uganda to overcome COVID-19, which has since claimed about 58 Ugandan lives with 5,123 infections. The scientists led by Dr. Bruce Kirenga of Makere University Lung Institute and the Deputy Vice-Chancellor Professor William Bazeo have collected blood samples which contain antibodies from individuals who recovered from the virus with very high chances of overcoming the disease. Science is simple. Now, how does the plasma work? What we, what we are saying is that when you get infection, you make antibodies. And those antibodies, they go and attack the infection and neutralize it. And that's how we heal from these infections. Now, what we are doing is we are getting these antibodies from healed people and give this, them to this person who has not yet made his own antibodies and neutralize the virus in real time. And where these, some studies have been done, there is dramatic improvement in symptoms when these antibodies are given. We have tested for the antibodies in this plasma, and we have shown that it contains very high levels of these antibodies. However, there are other countries doing similar trials on convalescent plasma to treat COVID-19. This has been done in high-income countries, in the USA, in Europe, in China, in Africa, South Africa, and Ghana. The College of Health Sciences is not short of intellectual stock, and we pledge to exponentially think and make the lives of Ugandans better. The scientists are now inviting all COVID-19 recovery patients to donate blood samples so that they can extract antibodies that can be used in fighting COVID-19. A person can donate as many times as about four times a year. Wherever you are, take a trip and come willingly. A recent study carried out in the U.S. on 35,000 people produced 48% success of using convalescent plasma in treating COVID-19. The minister cautioned Ugandans who still think COVID-19 is a joke. COVID is real. COVID is with us and it can take any of us. It has actually taken very prominent people from our society. Jingo Francis, NTV.